G'day sports fans, welcome to my first video on how to not let anger affect your golf scores anywhere near as much anymore. But the first one, this one, number one, is it's okay to get angry. That might be a bit counterintuitive to a few of you that have been told you shouldn't get angry on the golf course, stop getting angry, anger's not going to be any good for you, rah, rah, rah. I heard it all the time as well, until eventually someone said to me, no, it's okay to get angry on the golf course. Anger's telling you something. What is it telling you? Don't bottle it up because you'll end up like a pressure cooker if you just keep holding it in, holding it in, holding it in, holding it in, and then all of a sudden you'll go bang, and it'll explode, and you'll snap, and then you'll make silly decisions, you'll throw clubs you'll give up and your whole day and round is ruined. So first thing, number one, it's okay to get angry. Hang around for number two to see what the next steps are in, in reducing your anger and improving your scores. 